much more difficult equation to solve for. It says 1 over p plus 1 over q equals 1 over f. And this is a, a type of equation that we'll encounter in physics, especially when we get to optics. And let me show you a wrong way that students do it. They'll get 1 over q by itself by subtracting 1 over p. And so they end up with 1 over q equals 1 over f minus 1 over p. And then they'll come in and take the reciprocal to get q equals f minus p. This is incorrect. It's a much more, you cannot take the reciprocal of this right side because these are dealing with two fractions here, not one. So this approach was incorrect. So what I'm going to do now is rework this problem the correct way. And we start it the same way. We'll get q by itself on the left side. 1 over q equals 1 over f minus 1 over p. But you need to recall uh, what to do with, with fractions that have different denominators. And what we do with those is we get a like denominator denominator. So a like denominator of f and p would be f times p. And so you come over here, f will go into f one time, um, p times. f will go into f p, p times. So it's p and p will go into p minus, p will go into p f times. So it's p minus f. So what we have is 1 over q equals p minus f over fp and now you're at a point in the problem where you can take the reciprocal to get the correct answer. So if we take the reciprocal of the left side, we have to take the reciprocal of the right side. And so that gives us q equals fp divided by p minus f. And this is the correct way to solve for q in this problem.